The Bible speaks of a lady who was demon possessed. When you read in the book of Luke chapter 8 verse 2, it says, And certain women which had been healed of evil spirits and infirmities, Mary called Magdalene, out of whom seven devils were cast out. Uh, we, we, the Bible shares a story of a lady who had a challenge. This lady, the Bible says, prior before she met Christ, she was demon possessed. The other writers have uh, uh, concluded that Magdalene is not a surname. She was actually the queen of Magdala. She was known for being the queen of Magdala. She, she was a lady who was so generous to any man who was there. In other words, we find a lady who was demon possessed. We find a lady who lived a loose life. We find a lady who enjoyed sleeping with any man who was available on that day. But guess what? She met Christ and she never remained the same again. You know, my dear brothers and sisters, that when you meet Christ and encounter with Jesus, you never remain the same again. If we had a privilege, we're going to ask a man called Patimius. He will tell you that all my life I was a blind man. I met Christ and he, um, uh, he was able to open my eyes. If we had a privilege, we're going to ask him, the, lazy, the lady, the Syrophoenician lady, the Bible says she met Christ, brought her request, and the child was healed. What am I saying to you, my dear friends? I am saying to you, when we meet Christ, he, he accepts us as we are, but he does not leave us the same. He begins to work in our lives. He changes our minds, he renews our minds, and he transforms our hearts so that we become new creatures. I am saying to you, my dear friends, there is no way you can meet Christ and remain the same again. Remember, this same Mary, we had a history, we had a track record of being demon-possessed. The Bible says after she met Christ, she followed Jesus wherever Jesus was. And at, in the resurrection of Christ, go and read John chapter 20 verse 16. The Bible will tell you that the first person who saw Christ after he resurrected was this same Mary. Listen to me. This same Mary was once demon possessed. This same Mary, we had some evil habits. This same Mary was struggling to overcome um, the desire to, to, to sleep with different men. This Mary who thought he had, she had a problem within her blood that was stronger than her. We find her following Jesus. We find her uh, abiding in the presence of Jesus and enjoying being a follower of Jesus. She overcame all the evil happens through the grace of Christ. I am saying to you, when we meet Christ, we don't remain the same again. We, when we meet Christ, we become followers of Christ. He begins to work in us. Christ does not call us to clean ourselves up. Then we follow him. He says, follow me. Then he begins the process of cleaning us up. My dear friends, we serve a God who loves us so much. He accepts us as we are, but he, he does not want us to remain the same. He lifts us up and he sets us on a rock, a rock of living a pure life, a moral life, of living a life of peace. May the Lord bless you.